Hi everyone, I'm Reverend Kate Wilkinson, minister here at the Unitarian Universalist Meeting House of Provincetown. We are so sad not to be gathering weekly with all of you in our beautiful historic sanctuary here in Provincetown. But rather than seeing this time only as a time of loss, we're also trying to see it as a time of opportunity. So we're taking some time while our building is closed to the public to do some important restoration work in our sanctuary. We really value preserving this beautiful space for generations to come and also making it as accessible as possible to all who come through our doors. So the pews were constructed of white pine and as you can see they're trimmed, uh, this is mahogany that uh, reportedly originally was used as ballast on ships. Uh, these were all built by local seamen and fishermen off-season. Uh, they, they didn't bring in contractors or, or carpenters, they just they built it themselves. Um, and as, if you start to look at it more closely, you'll see there are just sort of scuff marks, these places where masking tape was put on, where it's still stuck there, scuff marks again. Um, if you look at the backboards underneath the pews, just years and years of people rubbing their shoes against it. Um, so a lot of what's going to be happening here is just cleaning, just giving the sanctuary a good cleaning, and then doing some spot retouching to blend in uh, where we have to so that we don't lose this sense of an aged building. We don't want uh, a fresh coat of paint put on everything. That's, that's not our goal. It's just to clean things up. We know that this is a difficult time for so many of us. So it's an awkward time to be announcing a new fundraising campaign. But we also know that you too love this place and want to take care of it into the future. So any contribution you can make toward this historically sensitive restoration of our beautiful sanctuary will be greatly appreciated. Our fundraising goal for this work is to raise $20,000 through the incredible generosity of some members of the congregation, we have a $10,000 match. So once we've raised the 10,000, then that will be matched with another 10,000, bringing us completely to the goal that we need to do this important work. Here's a good example of the kind of work that will be done. If you look at the back of this pew, um, there's places where the paint has sort of worn away. And there's also um, some sort of markings that have been, been put on there. So these will be um, really carefully cleaned and then the idea is just going to be to sort of feather in very sort of carefully uh, paint where it's worn away so that we maintain the overall feel of the age of the pew uh, while bringing it back to a, a, a more original appearance. Another part of this project will be some steps to improve accessibility to the meeting house. Specifically, we're going to remove one row of pews so that our members and friends who use wheelchairs or scooters will have an easier time accessing service and other events at the meeting house.